It is a wonderful day for all those participants that are going to come and use this centre. It is a wonderful day for the corporate citizens who will be able to say we were part of the community and that this will be a showpiece for them going forward for many years. What a name, Medigar got a barak. Hello friends. I'm one of the Aboriginal elders of Western Sydney. You become an elder, you have to do lots and lots of work in your community before you get respect in return. And we as elders, we go out and teach how to break down barriers and build bridges. We're out there in the community trying to turn people's lives around. The Connectivity Centre is setting out to achieve genuine and long-term change in people's lives. Some of you will be aware of Multiplex's ambitious commitments to supporting apprentices and trainees through this project. And the Connectivity Centre will play a special part in this. This space was renovated by a group of 10 participants from our first Indigenous pre-vocational training programme, all of whom are now trainees. What the Conductivity Centre is, is a physical location that allows agencies that are involved in dealing with employment issues to come together to work collaboratively to find solutions. We have a particular focus to groups that are in one form or another are suffering disadvantage. For Multiplex, it's about us working with those agencies to work out how we can provide access for people looking for employment how we can work with them to make sure that the employment opportunities are sustainable. The centre itself has come along in leaps and bounds. It, it started off as a derelict building and it's turned into something functional and quite fantastic. We've been on the ground here from day one, selecting who the first cohort of trainees would be in conjunction with the other partners, helping them as they progress through their training and now into the beginning of their traineeship. I think it's important to emphasise the fact that Multiplex don't see themselves as being a solution to every problem in the community. We don't make an assumption on the community's behalf as to what social value represents. We ask the community what it represents for them. But we do recognise that we've got the opportunity to make a significant contribution. This really is the pinnacle of healthcare in this state. We know that the construction job generation here is going to be incredibly high, 1,500 odd jobs in construction, 50 apprenticeships coming through here, again creating careers. That generation of career opportunities, not just ticking a box around getting a, a particular pass mark of you know 1.5% in Aboriginal participation, that's what this is about. This is about truly creating opportunities and pathways for people. But I think the most important piece here is that we see Westmead as a precinct being an economic hub for the state. The stakeholders involved with the Connectivity Centre are all specialists in their own particular area. The idea is to provide a venue for them to work collaboratively to find solutions to some of the issues around employment. The collaboration that we're allowed to put together from the support of Multiplex is sensational and all that comes together to provide an amazing journey and facility for the participants that are coming through here to service Multiplex in pre-employment and on-the-job traineeships in ensuring they've got the skills and knowledge to go home to their families after working safely all day. Something really special to be involved in. We decided a long time ago that um, the best way to help a young person achieve economic and social independence is through a job and so we uh, really welcome the opportunity to partner with organisations such as Multiplex who are genuine about um, providing career and job opportunities for, for young people, especially uh, young people that need a hand. The Connectivity Centre uh, to me means that a, an organisation like Multiplex leaves behind more than a building, it leaves behind a skill legacy, an employment and economic legacy for local people, local communities and it can change lives, it can change generational unemployment. You, you provide one person in a family with a job and career opportunity from a family that hasn't worked before and you change future generations. What we're bringing into the Westmead Connectivity Centre is our Skill Me project, which is about helping uh, refugees and migrants get into training pathways and into employment. We've also brought in our Dress for Work program, which is about giving men suits and the right sort of apparel to go to a job interview. Also, some of the working apparel that they might need to see them through, things like work boots, uh, safety vests and so on. 
PC Was is really excited to be a part of the connectivity centre. This is the first time we've joined up with Multiplex and with Karen Hope here, our General Manager of People, Culture and Programs. We look forward to working with the centre and training up the young people to get jobs. Our role here primarily is to create career opportunities for Aboriginal people. The Connectivity Centre will become what it needs to become and hopefully we'll just build perhaps what will become a benchmark for this sort of activity. And this place consists of seven partners. These partners bring together a power that enables us to think differently about what healthcare will mean from a community point of view and an individual point of view in the next decade. Well, we know from our past experience that we have made a contribution to the resilience of communities by working collaboratively with people who are at the call phase dealing with these issues on a day-to-day -day basis by combining their experience with ours by providing access to jobs that people wouldn't normally have access to. We know that there are some terrific outcomes to be achieved.